The main message was actually to show that there is a progress possible. There can be a change. Uh, even we did not expect this to happen in the last decade, but yeah, this happened and we wanted to tell this to the other organizations, other countries, that countries can change their opinions, countries can become progressive. So, so this was my main message on that the change is possible and that you could fight for human rights and there, there will be a result for this. It, it, it is, it's really like the situation is really diverse. It's like once you see it, uh, what's happening in UK, it's like UK should be the one of the most uh, LGBT friendly country in the entire Europe, let's say. And then, then you can see the, the countries like Uzbekistan where it's still criminal to be gay. So, so the situation is really diverse. And you can look from the like very bright situation when data shows like there have been a lot of hu uh, hate crimes in the areas, but that's because people are not afraid to report. And then you go, for example, to Central Eastern Europe, then there is no reporting, as for us, almost no reporting because people are afraid. And then there are countries like you see in the Central Asia that, that are, are afraid to come out because they're, they are in danger. Or you see Russia that is limiting the freedom of speech and freedom of assembly for LGBT people, the same Belarus. And we were just a uh, witness of uh, what happened in Ukraine just yesterday, a couple hours before our site event, uh, Ukraine uh, adopted in the first reading so-called anti-homosexual, uh, like homosexualism propaganda ban. So, so the situation is really diverse, but the good thing is that you can share this and you can learn over here if, of course, the NGOs want to and if the countries want to. This is the place where you can raise your voice, like you could, uh, you can tell what, what is important for you, for your community. Uh, you can tell it not just as we usually do for other NGOs, even if we are small NGO, not just for other European NGOs. This we can say to the entire uh, OSC region, for the governments, so we can be heard starting from United States till Uzbekistan, for example. So our voice going to be heard. It really depends on what level, but it is important. And I think this is a kind of a unique platform when we can, when we can kind of spread our message. So it is pretty wider so that we are usually used to, we can do that within the Council of Europe, within the European Union. But I think it's like, this is the progress, this is the place where we can give the progressive message even to the countries that are not that open to our ideas.